In today's video, we're going to be comparing the differences from Canva and Adobe CC Express. We're going to explore which one is better and what you should choose. First thing we're going to look at is features. Canva has a video editor, which is pretty good. Adobe CC Express also has a video editor. However, Adobe CC Express has many more features such as removing background, editing images, converting videos to GIFs, and so on. Next, we're going to be talking about interface, which is easier to use and if it's easy to navigate around the app. First of all, both apps are mobile and web supported, so it's nice. Adobe CC and Canva's home screen are basically identical. They have templates and sizes, and when it comes to the editor, it feels like Canva has less built-in functions, as Adobe CC Express has more buttons as elements, icons, resize. However, resize does require Pro just like Canva and some other features, but it feels like Canva just doesn't show the Pro features. A lot of cheap or free graphic design sites often end with a watermark when you export. However, this is not the case for Adobe CC Express or Canva. I've tested with two free accounts and after downloading both, I have not gotten a watermark, which is really good as many people complain about watermarks in their thumbnails and it just looks bad. Other features include things like uploading images from different sites. For example, Canva can upload from Google Drive, Instagram for some reason, Facebook, and Dropbox. I don't really understand what Facebook and Instagram means, which is weird. I am guessing you could upload images from your account. I just don't really understand. However, Adobe, Adobe obviously has their own cloud system, Google Drive, Dropbox, Google Photos, which is pretty good, Lightroom, and, and you can obviously search just stock photos. Going Pro is about upgrading your membership to premium, and that means you get more features. The prices are very tight, but Adobe CC Express barely wins. Both apps premium version both include similar perks however i do not recommend buying pro i recommend you just skipping that and going to photoshop and buying a good bundle which costs around 80 dollars and having all these apps is a really good deal so i recommend you do get this if you do want to go pro in a nutshell adobe cc express wins because just think about this, Adobe CC Express is basically Photoshop but with less features. Photoshop is amazing, graphic designer, it's basically one of the best. Adobe CC is just um, a downgrade, which isn't that bad. So hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Please leave a like and subscribe, join the Discord community and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!